happened to me was I was uploading a video onto YouTube and it was taking a really really long time so let me show you the video that I was uh, uploading and uh, this is the gaming review of the Nokia Lumia 525 that I recently did on my channel uh, so this was the video and uh, let me show you just the file size of this video this is 1.08 GBs and after editing it, uh, this is 1.08 GB. This is the final video that I, I, I had edited. And also this is uh, 19 minutes long. So it's a pretty long video. Uh, I wanted to upload this on YouTube but uh, my internet connection uh, was very very bad at that time. And it was taking really really long time and also uh, in between it stopped two times so I have to start the upload again so if you are in a situation like me or if you just want to upload your videos faster and so fast that you can't believe uh, today I'm gonna show you a secret method that uh, not a secret method but a method that you can use to upload your videos really fast on YouTube so this is what you are searching for and this would be really really helpful for you so uh, first you what you need to do is you need to go to your web browser and Google or any other search en engine that you may use and search for uh, this term called handbrake so this is the website handbrake uh, handbrake.fr I will leave the links uh, in the description down below so this is the website handbrake.fr uh, you just download this software and install it uh, so this is basically a software that compresses your video and uh, without losing any of the quality of video it compresses it uh, and makes the file size much 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 small, smaller and uh, nothing is compromised not uh, not any of your video quality so the quality remains same and your video file becomes drastically smaller so uh, I'm, I, I think I'm discussing too much. Let me just show you the magic. So uh, this is the software. Just download it and install it. After installing it, uh, just open it. I have this uh, software in the taskbar because I use it too much. So after you have installed it, okay. Uh, now what you need to do is uh, you need to uh, now I you need to have a video file. So I'll just take uh, a video file. Um, like I will take a raw video file from my camera so uh, you know the raw files are much much larger so this is a file let me just take a file from here um, just hold on. this is a raw file like this this is a, a survey surfer gameplay can see uh, I will see the properties and this is 631 MBs and this is in .mov format so this is completely raw file so this is a raw file 631 MBs let's check how small we can get it's uh, of 1 minute and 50 seconds 631 MBs now what you have to do on this software in this software is uh, just double uh, double click normal and go to source and open file and just uh, locate your video open file uh, videos DGN. gaming review and subway surfers open so uh, it says we are ready now uh, you have to choose your destination where the file will be saved the uh, converted file or the compressed file so browse for the location over here I will just use this and set the file name I will set subway surfer to save and then uh, you, you need to change nothing uh, over here just uh, click on video then in uh, here the constant quality uh, this is the trick 
by the way uh, in here the constant quality uh, you just slide it over to here 28 now this is what I use and this is what I recommend so if you use this uh, I'll make sure uh, you won't be losing any of the quality of your video so I uh, I use this I generally use this this is 28 just uh, just move the slider to the 28 uh, number and uh, just click on this start button so let's say start and it will start its process so it's doing its process and I'll be back when it's done and he's 7, 98, 99 and 100 so uh, it says queue finished and it's done now now I'll just close this window and take a look at this file so this is the Subway Surfers 2 file now what I will do is I will uh, show you the quality first and then I will show you the actual file size of both these so let's see let's take a look at the quality of Subway Surfers uh, oops let me just load it in a different player let's say uh, VLC media player so as you can see here this is the quality of the original survey surfers uh, that I recorded survey surfers dot mov uh, the DSLR raw file now I'll just pause this over here at 16 seconds and I'll just open the survey surfers to VLC media player um, it just opened in the same uh, okay I'll just use another player this is the Subway Surface 2 by the way and I'll just pause it at 16 16 okay so this is the quality at 16 in this and uh, over here I will just open it in Windows Media Player and just let me pause this this is the original Surface Surfer the Subway Surfer 1 so on the right hand side uh, you can see just let me just call it to 16 16 ok 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 uh, so here is the difference between quality uh, this on the right hand side is the original one and this on the left hand side is the compressed one so is there any difference that are you noticing uh, so it's 17 let me just scroll back to 16 okay this is 16 so uh, over here at the left hand side the quality seems to be perfect for me and over here on the right hand side the quality is also perfect for me so absolutely no no such major difference in the quality just let us just look at the file size now let me just close both these windows now let's just look at the file size the audio is the same by the way uh, service of us to properties this is just 23.2 MBs just 23.2 MBs and this the original one is 631 MBs so uh, that is the difference that is the magic behind this software so this is the magic and you can use this software to I will leave all the links down in the description below if you have any other queries just uh, do ask me in the comment section below I also do have a Facebook page uh, where you can ask me the queries uh, the, uh, you can uh, the links are in the description down below and uh, and uh, do remember to subscribe, that really helps me. Thanks a lot for watching.